Hello everyone, welcome to our Scratch game programming tutorial. This is our ninth lecture. So the title of this lecture is Duplicating Sprites and Costumes. So let's see how we can uh, duplicate, uh, duplicate a sprite. So let's start with this cat. Let's change the name of this file. Duplicate. So when you start, remember you always start with a cat, right? And I want to uh, make several sprites. Okay. So I can see that the name of this sprite is sprite one. I want to change the name. So if you click this I from here, you can change the name. So I'm gonna say cat, right? You can see there are some. Um, information you can see um, the position of the cat you can see the direction rotation style and everything so we just want to change the name so it's cat um, so if you want to duplicate so there is a button here duplicate so if I click this and click on this cat I can see I have another cat and the name is cat2 right and if I click on this cat again I see there is another cat cat3 if I click duplicate and click on the first I can see there is another cat so I have four cats and you can see that they're randomly placed so you can drag them next to each other and now we have four cats right so we can duplicate sprites and we can also duplicate costumes okay so remember why we need uh, more costumes so I explained this before but uh, I'll give you a summary again so for example if you see that if I switch between these two costumes rapidly it seems that the cat is walking so I can write my code in a way so that it will look like that the cat is walking if I switch between these two costumes right so that's why we need um, costumes if you want to see more expressions let's say you want to make a smiley face or you want to make a sad face you can do that too so for example let's say something happened and you want to show a sad face you can do that okay so I'll show you that later on so right now we want to duplicate costumes but instead of cat let's use something else so let's uh, delete um, all these cats so I can use the scissors so now, right now I don't have any sprites so let's get a new sprite let's get this apple so I want to duplicate this apple but I want to duplicate the costumes I want um, different colored uh, apples so right now I have only one so how we can duplicate so I click on duplicate I click on this costume remember this is a costume I'm not clicking on the sprite okay so I click on this apple so I see I have another costume so what I want I want to switch to a different costume but that will be a different color so right now you can see it's a red apple so let's change this color so if you remember that from here you can change the color so you can say color a shape I click on this and I want to choose uh, green so I can see now I have a green apple right and um, what I want to do next is remember you have green apple but this is a costume and this is red but what I want I want dupli I want to duplicate costumes as well as the sprites okay so to duplicate the costume I mean duplicate the sprite I click on the sprite 
and I can see that this is Apple 2. So if, it, if you click on Apple 2, we can see that you have red and you have a green apple. And if you click on the first one, you see it's similar. Okay, so for the first apple, if you click on this, one will be red, another will be green. And I want another costume, so duplicate. And right now I want a golden apple, so let's choose the color. So now I have three types, right? So I have a red apple, I have a green apple, and a golden apple. So for the first one, I want to keep the red apple. So I make another duplicate and then change this to green so I can see that I have three colored apple and I made this duplicate so remember for the first sprite I have these two costumes red and green for the second one I have three costumes I have red I have green and I have golden the third apple I also have three with the first one I have only two so that means you can add more costumes and you can add more sprites so this is how duplication works so why you want to duplicate so for example you want to build an army right and you want to duplicate each of the sprites or you want to duplicate the costumes so you can do that right so there will be um, actually there is another way to make this task simpler so duplication and remember you need to click this duplicate again and again right and instead of duplicate uh, we can use cloning so next lecture we will have cloning all right so that's it for today everyone and i'll see you next time bye